हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल फॉर नर्सेज प्रिपरेशन आई एम नीरज कुमार कैथल टुडे वी आर प्रेजेंटिंग 11 इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट्स फ्रॉम द टॉपिक बायोमेडिकल वेस्ट लेट्स बिगिन आर वीडियो पॉइंट नंबर वन बायो हेल्थ अजार्ट्स लेट सी द डेफिनेशन ऑफ बायो हेल्थ अजार्ट्स anything that is actually or potentially harmful to humans other species or environment known as bio health hazards any substance that is harmful to humans other species or environment known as bio health hazards point number 2 in hospital waste management plastic bag of black yellow red blue or white translucent are used to segregate the waste that is generated in the hospital or for the disposal of hospital waste we are using four color bags these are black yellow red blue or white point number 3 let's see which type of waste is segregated in yellow bag first human anatomical waste human anatomical waste like human tissue organ fetus below viability period and placenta all are collected in the yellow color bag solid waste like contaminated with blood and body fluids example dressings plaster cast to cotton and swab all also are included in the yellow bag other substances that are collected in yellow bag are infected secretions aspirated body fluids blood bags laboratory cultures etc point number 4 now let's talk about the black color bag in this bag we collect office papers kitchen waste and tissue paper if you want you can take a screenshot of this slide now let's talk about the point number 5 red bag in this bag we collect infectious plastic waste it includes infected iv tubings catheters rail tubes cannulas gloves cut syringes etc to collect infected iv tubings catheters rail tubes cannula gloves cut syringes we use red color bag always remember red r stands for rubber so rubber related or plastic related waste should be collected in red bag point number 6 previously in hospitals blue color bag was used but nowadays it was replaced by the white color puncher proof container it is not a bag it is a white color puncher proof container we use dispose to dispose sharp items in this bag examples like needles syringes blades etc white color puncher proof container in this we use to dispose sharp items like needles syringe blades etc point number 7 what is sewage waste water and solid waste includes fecal matter of residential and commercial establishments called sewage sewage is a waste water and solid waste it includes fecal matters of residential and commercial establishments called sewage similar term point number 8 sewage what is sewage household liquid waste like water but without fecal contamination known as sewage always remember a water waste or a semi solid waste without fecal matter known as sewage and waste water with fecal matter or fetal fecal waste known as sewage point number 9 medical waste treatment method we can treat the medical waste by five methods these are incineration autoclaving microwaving chemical and biological method 
Incineration means simply we burn the waste. Autoclaving is a method of sterilization in which we are using high pressure steam. Microwaving, you know, we are using microwaves to disinfect or treat the substances. Chemical with the use of chemicals. Biological method with enzymes, we treat the waste. Point number 10. Incineration. Incineration is done for human anatomical waste. Incineration means simply burning. Incineration means simple burning. Incineration is used for human anatomical waste. Point number 11, last point of this video. Phenol can be used for sputum disposal. Phenol is a chemical that is used for disposal of sputum. So everyone, this all the important points you can take a screenshot if you want for your revision purpose. Thank you so much for watching this complete video. All the best.